Okay, how many of you people saw that they're making a Marvel Zombies board game? I, for one, was personally very excited for it. Now, the price tag is way too high for me to justify spending on a board game that I'd probably just play by myself. But, I was looking at the Kickstarter and I, I noticed something. Now, obviously, the main, the main zombies in the game, Captain America was one of them, okay? You know, basic, makes sense. And they have a hero mode where it's like the X-Men, they're gonna fight the zombies. And that's pretty cool, too. And Magneto is definitely part of the good guys in this time. So, good, good, good. And they have this whole different set, like a whole Fantastic Four expansion, and most of the characters have an alternate hero or zombie mode. Except for one. There is one character who, you know, didn't get a living version to play with, apparently. Captain America. Why? And first thing people want to say, oh, but Will, he's just your favorite superhero. You, you, of course you want him more of him. I'm like, well, yes, that is true, but that's not the point. I mean, it is partially, it's not really a point here. Is that A, everybody else gets alternate versions. Who the heck wants to play Zombie Kingpin? Really? And why does the Winter Soldier not just get a zombie version, but a living version? But Captain America can't get a living version either. I mean, for crying out loud. I mean, you'll give all these other random heroes, but you not even give Captain America a living version. You only have a partial design here. Just remove the zombie bits. Or re-add the non-zombie bits. So, how do you want to return that? And this is the wider trend in the Marvel Zombies media that I just do not get. Captain America gets no real presence as part of the living team. Even as a zombie, he's usually sidelined. He occasionally gets his moments, but it's a, he never gets to do anything really when he's alive. In the main series, he was killed in the start and then killed by Red Skull again later. But the point is, Captain America didn't get to do nothing alive then. In Marvel Zombies Resurrection, he was just, he managed to tell Thor to go away, but then he was dead. So he died literally in the first issue. In the Marvel Zombies What If series, he literally gets bit by the zombie equivalent of a mosquito. Now, yes, I know that was the older Ant-Man, and I don't care. It's still a stupid way to kill off a major character like that. In the board game, this was the one time we could have really had Captain America be played. You know, he really could have had screen presence because it's like, oh yeah, you can tell your own Marvel zombie story. You can play as Captain America, but only as a zombie. Why? Why is the Marvel Zombies franchise so solely dedicated to making sure Captain America gets no screen time as a living person? And it's so weird because as a living person, he could easily be one of the most fun characters to watch. Think about it. He has no zombie, necessarily no knowledge of zombie media. He would have no idea if how zombie zombies work. I mean, the most he might ever know would be something like a Haitian voodoo zombie, which isn't going to help him much. And so that could be an easy justification for someone like Spider-Man or Tony to tell him how zombies work in this universe or how they're going to work for this story. You know, basically exposition dump on ya. Captain America could also be logically said to be immune since his body is superior to that of the average human and is sometimes resistant or straight up immune to all diseases. You could easily justify him being immune. But more importantly, if he is immune to the zombie virus, then that is actually great, not just because it would let you have some more fun with Captain America and not have to worry about him taking even a point of damage, but it would also let you do a really, you know, little fun thing where you could justify, since all of his stuff like that comes from the super soldier serum, you could justify that as a way to fix the war, like, oh, we just have to get a sample of Captain America's blood and we can make, like, some kind of reduced super soldier serum that would, that would keep anyone who hasn't been infected yet from being infected, easily giving you a mission for the story, even if it does work out like Captain America dies at some point before that can happen, or you have to find Captain America's. All I'm saying is, there's a lot of stuff you can do with Captain America and a Marvel zombie type story, and the fact they haven't done anything with them, especially because he's a very tactical leadership character who could be useful in that kind of situation. To wrangle together characters who don't always like each other or disagree with what to do, who could wrangle them into a sensible team. This would be great for Captain America, but we don't get to see him do any of this. Now, I'm sure a lot of people are kind of done to death with Marvel Zombies, or the person, that, especially the main one, is one of my fate is honestly one of the best, well, I don't want to say the best Marvel Zombies, well, no, that's not true, one of the better, not even that, it's like, it's, a, it's an interesting story, that's all I'm going to say, and it's just kind of disappointing that Captain America never gets to do anything in these stories, and it's just kind of sad, even the stories that are kind of like Marvel Zombies, like the um, Punisher versus the Giant Campbells thing, he, he just kind of dies, I'm sure he takes some zombies, but then, Punch has to kill him because, of course, he is not immune because reasons. All I'm saying is, I'd love to see Captain America in a Marvel zombie story as a living person. Give him some screen time, let him let him react to things, and it'd be fun. See how he bounces off of the characters, what he prioritizes in these kind of situations. It would be fun. That's all I'm saying. Anyway, I'll see you next time.
do you hey why don't you hit that sub button you're gonna become a subscriber get to see my content quicker wouldn't that be nice i bet so